via comrades as a Ghanaian trained in Cuba since my adolescence. I want to thank the Cuban Revolution and its Commander-in-Chief Fidel Castro Ruz on my behalf and on behalf of the thousands of young people in my country and on the African continent for being able to share our studies, our hopes, and our dreams on the Isle of Youth. Today, thanks to Cuba, I have the opportunity to put the acquired knowledge to contribute to the development of my beloved country. However, as a Ghanaian Cuban, I observe with concern how a country with such solidarity attitude as Cuba has suffered more than six decades a criminal and a genocidal economic, commercial, and financial blockade by the most arrogant and aggressive power in the history of mankind. As a Ghanaian Cuban, I strongly express my condemnation of the strangulation activity against the Cuban people carried out by the current U.S. administration, which even in the midst of the global difficulties derived from the impact of the COVID-19 pandemic, deals with by all means of preventing the arrival of the supplies and medicines to its needs for its population and especially for the care of the most vulnerable, such as children, people living with disability, and the aged from reaching Cuba. As a Ghanaian Cuban, I wish to express my appreciation to the Cuban people who from the moment of the triumph of their revolution express the highest vocation of internationalism and of which we graduate in Cuba are the best example. I salute a country that has contributed with its blood to the independence of many African countries and that today continue to send its doctors to face the COVID-19 pandemic in various countries of the world and the African continent in particular. As a Cuban, as a Ghanaian Cuban, I wish to express my solidarity with the government and people of Cuba in their struggle and justifiable show to leave the blockade and my rejection of any act of terrorism and incitement to subversion. I also join the international call for the Nobel Prize, Peace Prize to be awarded to the Henry Rave, Ravi International Medical Brigade for the humanitarian work carried out in the face of disaster situations, among which the confrontation with Ebola and the current COVID-19 pandemic. Long live the people of Cuba, long live Ghana, long live the solidarity with the people of Cuba, down with the blockade against Cuba, long live Fidel Castro and his eternal legacy, Long live the friendship between Africa and Cuba. El pueblo unido jamás serán vencidos. The people united will never be defeated. The people united will never de be defeated. Que morir por la patria es vivir. To die for the country is to live. To live in, in chains is shameful. I thank you very much for the opportunity offered to me as an African who was trained in Cuba to speak on behalf of my African people. We thank you. We love you, Cuba. Bless. Thank you.